Jude, also known as Judas Thaddeus Greek, Thaddeus Coptic, Syriac, Aramaic, Yaut Shlai was one of the Twelve Apostles of Jesus. He is generally identified with Thaddeus, and is also variously called Jude of James, Jude Thaddeus, Judas Thaddeus or Lebius. He is sometimes identified with Jude, the brother of Jesus, but is clearly distinguished from Judas Iscariot, the apostle who betrayed Jesus prior to his crucifixion. Judas Thaddeus became known as Jude after early translators of the New Testament from Greek into English sought to distinguish him from Judas Iscariot and subsequently abbreviated his forename. Most versions of the New Testament in languages other than English and French refer to Judas and Jude by the same name. The Armenian Apostolic Church honors Thaddeus along with Saint Bartholomew as its patron saints. In the Roman Catholic Church, he is the patron saint of desperate cases and lost causes. Saint Jude's attribute is a club. He is also often shown in icons with a flame around his head. This represents his presence at Pentecost, when he received the Holy Spirit with the other apostles. Another common attribute is Jude holding an image of Jesus Christ, known as the image of Edessa. In some instances, he may be shown with a scroll or a book the Epistle of Jude or holding a carpenter's rule. Topic identity topic topic New Testament topic Jude is clearly distinguished from Judas Iscariot, another apostle and later the betrayer of Jesus. Both Jude and Judas are translations of the name Iodas in the Koine Greek language original text of the New Testament, which in turn is a Greek variant of Judah Yuda, a name which was common among Jews at the time. In most Bibles in languages other than English and French, Jude and Judas are referred to by the same name. Aside from Judas Iscariot, the New Testament mentions Jude or Judas six times, in four different contexts, Jude of James, one of the twelve apostles Luke chapter 6 verse 16 and Acts chapter 1 verse 13, Judas, not Judas Iscariot, apparently an apostle John chapter 14 verse 22, the brother of Jesus Matthew chapter 13 verse 55, Mark chapter 6 verse 3, the writer of the epistle of Jude, who identifies himself as the brother of James Jude chapter 1 verse 1 the first two are almost always thought to be the same person, although theologian Raymond Brown saw the identification as uncertain. The latter two are also usually thought to be the same person, though this too is not certain. See Epistle of Jude. Catholic tradition generally holds all of these four to be the same person, while Protestants generally believe one and two to be one person, and three and four to be a one person, but different from one and two. Topic Brother of James or Son of James Topic Translations into English from the original Greek of the New Testament vary in their rendering of Luke chapter 6 verse 16 and Acts chapter 1 verse 13. A literal translation of the references to Jude in these passages gives Jude of James, as in Young's literal translation of the Bible, but scholars differ on whether this means Jude, brother of James, or Jude, son of James. The King James and the Douay Rheims versions call him Judas the brother of James, making him the same person as the writer of the Epistle of Jude, who identifies himself as Jude, the servant of Jesus Christ, and brother of James. Jude chapter 1 verse 1. Most modern translations including the New International Version, Revised Standard Version and New Revised Standard Version, identify him as Jude the son of James and not the same person as the author of the Epistle of Jude. Protestant scholar Daryl L. Bach writes that it must mean son, not brother, because when brother is intended, the Greek word for brother, Adolphos, is present. Bach also says that means he was not the brother of Jesus. <laughs> Topic. Brother of Jesus? Topic. Opinion is divided on whether Jude the Apostle was also Jude, brother of Jesus, the traditional author of the Epistle of Jude. Generally, Catholics believe the two Judes are the same person, while Protestants generally do not. According to the surviving fragments of the work Exposition of the Sayings of the Lord of the Apostolic Father Papias of Hierapolis, who lived c. 72-163 AD, Mary the wife of Cleophas or Alpheus would be the mother of Judas the brother of Jesus that Papias identifies with Thaddeus. Mary the wife of Cleophas or Alpheus, who was the mother of James the bishop and apostle, and of Simon and Thaddeus, and of one Joseph. Fragment X Topic. Possible identity with Thaddeus 
In the apostolic lists at Matthew chapter 10 verse 3 and Mark chapter 3 verse 18, Jude is omitted, but there is a Thaddeus or in some manuscripts of Matthew chapter 10 verse 3, Lebius who was surnamed Thaddeus, and therefore in the King James Version listed in his place. This has led many Christians since early times to harmonize the lists by positing a Jude Thaddeus, known by either name. This is made plausible by the fact that Thaddeus seems to be a nickname see Thaddeus and that many New Testament figures have multiple names such as Simon Peter and Joseph Barnabas. A further complication is the fact that the name Judas was tarnished by Judas Iscariot. It has been argued that for this reason it is unsurprising that Mark and Matthew refer to him by an alternate name. Some biblical scholars reject this theory, however, holding that Jude and Thaddeus did not represent the same person. Scholars have proposed alternative theories to explain the discrepancy, an unrecorded replacement of one for the other during the ministry of Jesus because of apostasy or death, the possibility that 12 was a symbolic number and an estimation, or simply that the names were not recorded perfectly by the early church. Thaddeus, one of the twelve apostles, is often indistinguishable from Thaddeus of Edessa, one of the seventy disciples. In some Latin manuscripts of Matthew chapter 10, verse 3, Thaddeus is called Judas the Zealot. Topic. In other manuscripts Topic. According to the Golden Legend, which is a collection of hagiographies, compiled by Jacobus de Veragine in the 13th century, this Judas was called by many names. He was said Judas James, for he was brother to James the Less, and he was called Thaddeus, which is as much to say as taking a prince, or Thaddeus said of Thaddea, that is a vestor, and of Deus, that is God, for he was vestor royal of God by ornament of virtues, by which he took Christ the prince. He is said also in the history ecclesiastic, Lebius, which is as much to say as heart, or worshipper of heart. Or he is said Lebius of Lebes, that is a vessel of heart by great hardiness, or a worshipper of heart by purity, a vessel by plenitude of grace, for he deserved to be a vessel of virtues and a cauldron of grace. The same work writes that, Simon Cananean and Judas Thaddeus were brethren of James the Less and sons of Mary Cleophas, which was married to Alpheus. <laughs> Tradition and legend Topic. Tradition holds that St. Jude preached the gospel in Judea, Samaria, Adumaea, Syria, Mesopotamia and Libya. He is also said to have visited Beirut and Edessa, though the emissary of the latter mission is also identified as Thaddeus of Edessa, Adai, one of the seventy. The 14th-century writer Nicophorus Callistus makes Jude the bridegroom at the wedding at Cana. The legend reports that Street Jude was born into a Jewish family in Panias, a town in Galilee later rebuilt during the Roman period and renamed Caesarea Philippi. In all probability, he spoke both Greek and Aramaic, like almost all of his contemporaries in that area, and was a farmer by trade. According to the legend, Street Jude, son of Clopas and Mary of Clopas, sister of Virgin Mary. Tradition has it that Jude's father, Clopas, was martyred because of his forthright and outspoken devotion to the risen Christ. Although St. Gregory the Illuminator is credited as the Apostle to the Armenians, when he baptized King Tiridates III of Armenia in 301, converting the Armenians, the Apostles Jude and Bartholomew are traditionally believed to have been the first to bring Christianity to Armenia, and are therefore venerated as the patron saints of the Armenian Apostolic Church. Linked to this tradition is the St. Thaddeus Monastery now in northern Iran and St. Bartholomew Monastery now in southeastern Turkey which were both constructed in what was then Armenia. Tradition holds that Jude the Apostle was vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> Death and remains According to tradition, St. Jude suffered martyrdom about 65 AD in Beirut, in the Roman province of Syria, together with the Apostle Simon the Zealot, with whom he is usually connected. The axe that he is often shown holding in pictures symbolizes the way in which he was killed. Their acts and martyrdom were recorded in an Acts of Simon and Jude that was among the collection of passions and legends traditionally associated with the legendary Abdias, Bishop of Babylon, and said to have been translated into Latin by his disciple Tropaeus Africanus, according to the Golden Legend account of the saints. Sometime after his death, St. Jude's body was brought from Beirut to Rome and placed in a crypt in St. Peter. 
S. Basilica which was visited by many devotees. Now his bones are in the left transept of St. Peter's Basilica under the main altar of St. Joseph in one tomb with the remains of the Apostle Simon the Zealot. According to another popular tradition, the remains of St. Jude were preserved in an Armenian monastery on an island in the northern part of Isak Kul Lake in Kyrgyzstan at least until the mid-15th century. Later legends either deny that the remains are preserved there or claim that they were moved to a yet more desolate stronghold in the Pamir Mountains. Iconography Jude is traditionally depicted carrying the image of Jesus in his hand or close to his chest, betokening the legend of the image of Edessa, recorded in apocryphal correspondence between Jesus and Abgar which is reproduced in Eusebius. History Ecclesiastica, I, XIII. Eusebius relates that King Abgar of Edessa now Sanlirfa in southeast Turkey sent a letter to Jesus seeking a cure for an illness afflicting him. With the letter he sent his envoy Hanan, the keeper of the archives, offering his own home city to Jesus as a safe dwelling place. The envoy painted a likeness of Jesus with choice paints or alternatively, impressed with Abgar. S. Faith, Jesus pressed his face into a cloth and gave it to Hanan to take to Abgar with his answer. Upon seeing Jesus' image, the king placed it with great honor in one of his palatial houses. After Christ's execution, Jude Thomas the Apostle sent a die, one of the seventy or seventy-two in Luke chapter 10 verses 1 to 12 to King Abgar and the king was cured. Astonished, he converted to Christianity, along with many of the people under his rule. Additionally, Street Jude is often depicted with a flame above his head, representing his presence at Pentecost, when he was said to have received the Holy Spirit with the other apostles. Veneration According to tradition, after his martyrdom, pilgrims came to his grave to pray and many of them experienced the powerful intercessions of Saint Jude. Thus the title. The saint for the hopeless and the despaired. Saint Bridget of Sweden and Saint Bernard had visions from God asking each to accept Street Jude as the patron saint of the impossible. His feast day is the 28th of October, Roman Catholic Church, the Anglican Communion and Lutheran Church, and the 19th of June, Eastern Orthodox Church. The Order of Preachers, better known as the Dominicans, began working in present-day Armenia soon after their founding in 1216. At that time, there was already a substantial devotion to St. Jude by both Catholic and Orthodox Christians in the area. This lasted until persecution drove Christians from the area in the 18th century. Devotion to St. Jude began again in earnest in the 19th century, starting in Italy and Spain, spreading to South America, and finally to the United States starting in the vicinity of Chicago owing to the influence of the Claritians and the Dominicans in the 1920s. Patronage Among some Roman Catholics, St. Jude is venerated as the patron saint of lost causes. This practice stems from the belief that few Christians invoked him for misplaced fear of praying to Christ's betrayer, Judas Iscariot, because of their similar names. The ignored Jude thus supposedly became quite eager to assist anyone who sought his help, to the point of interceding in the most dire of circumstances. The Church also wanted to encourage veneration of this forgotten apostle, and maintained that St. Jude would intercede in any lost cause to prove his sanctity and zeal for Christ. St. Jude is the patron saint of the Chicago Police Department and of Clube de Regatas do Flamengo, a soccer team in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. His other patronages include desperate situations and hospitals. One of his namesakes is St. Jude Children's Research Hospital in Memphis, Tennessee, which has helped many children with terminal illnesses and their families since its founding in 1962. <laughs> Shrines and churches Many countries venerate the Apostle Jude and have constructed shrines or churches dedicated to his memory. Such sites include those in Australia, Brazil, Sri Lanka, Cuba, India, Iran, the Philippines, the United Kingdom, the United States and Lebanon. The National Shrine of St. Jude in Chicago, Illinois was founded in 1929 by the Claritian missionaries. 
The Nationwide Center of St. Jude Devotions in Baltimore was founded in 1917 by the Palatines. The National Shrine of St. Jude Thaddeus in the Philippines was erected by the Archdiocese of Manila in 1954 as a Spiritu Santo Chinese parish. The shrine holds the Saints Novena Liturgy every Thursday, and is now under the Society of the Divine Word that also runs the attached St. Jude Catholic School. The National Shrine of St. Jude at Faversham in England was founded in 1955. See also Statue of Jude the Apostle, Charles Bridge Veneration of Judas Thaddeus San Judas Tadeo in Mexico Topic Notes Topic Topic References Topic <references>